Hi, this is John May with Fathom Realty. The home selling process involves several steps. One important step that is often overlooked is home staging. Home staging is an essential part of the marketing process, which has been done for many years, even before the term was coined. However, there are certain beliefs that may lead others to confusion about it. Here are some common misconceptions of home staging. Number one, it's a very expensive phase of home selling. Home staging doesn't require you to spend your fortune. In fact, professional home stagers are in consensus that this phase requires as little amount as possible. The goal of this phase is more on showing how your house looks like in the eyes of the buyers and not show off your personal preferences and style as a dweller of the house. Misconception number two, home staging is an in thing for uh, some moment. As what has been said earlier, home staging is a process that has been around for many years even before the term came into existence. Therefore, it's not a fad or an in thing for an instance. It's to stay for many, many more years. It's not an ordinary principle which can be taken for granted. Doing so can harm your property on the selling list. It highlights the features of your house and makes them noticeable to potential buyers. In fact, staging has been on the spotlight and has been one of the primary reasons why many homes are sold. Number three, home staging is synonymous with home decorating. As much as we want to tell a story of our house to friends and relatives, this isn't exactly the goal of home staging. This is how different it is with home decorating, wherein we can add personal touches and styles. The goal of home staging is to let potential buyers see the living space. Let them picture themselves as they're already living in your house. Through staging, allow your house to be inviting and welcoming, yet not exaggerate it in the sense that they could be intruding on your personal lives. With staging, the balance between design and space is achieved. Number four, it's not essential for a house which has been vacant for, for long. There are homes on the seller's market which have been vacant for some years, but it doesn't mean that staging is not needed. You still need to let potential buyers imagine how their life would be in that house. Empty and dirty spaces would make the house feel cold and uninviting. Besides, a non-stage house creates the impression that the seller is desperate for furnishings and the house uh, into cash. Um, lastly, home staging is only done for large, expensive homes. No matter how big or small your house is for sale, it needs the help of home staging. There are just some of the myths associated with home staging. Eliminating them off of your system will help you make your home selling process more directed on the right path. For more information on how to sell your home for the most money and in the least amount of time, join me every Wednesday evening for my Home Selling Secrets webinar. You can register at www.freehomesellerswebinar.com. If you like my videos, subscribe to my YouTube channel and they'll be sent to you as they're posted.